Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. I am Pandora Fanatic. I'm back today with a, another troll beads haul. Um, I had some pieces arrive late last week and um, just uh, some pieces arrived today and I wanted to share my um, my new beads with you and let's get into it. Um, I hope you guys are having a good Friday the 13th uh, fortunately for us ours is over but it wasn't a bad day anyway anyway first up I want to show you how beautiful this bead is um, I believe it's called Milky Way and um, yeah it's quite dark here um, it's daylight um, but it's raining outside and it's kind of grey and overcast so if you can see the ring light and the reflection there that's not part of the bead um, yeah it looks like stars in the sky I'm trying to keep it in focus here I've got it on a rod that it wants to dance around on but yeah it's made to look like stars um, in the galaxy beautiful eh love it and it's clear it's clear and the magic's happening in the center now these are official beads they are from the troll bead store in australia is where i get them from except we have beach i've had my eye on this one for quite a while and um, the time was just right I'll take it off here I think or maybe not because I've got a few more beads to show you yet um this one here I just I just like I like the look of it and all the blues and I'll show you soon why I like it so much uh, these here they were definitely on the cards um, beautiful spaces I couldn't vouch for these anymore if I tried they're nice and thick they're nice and firm they're um, perfect for on a bangle and they're called infinite love and they have a beautiful design and also, I'll just show you some of the details from the sides, if I can. There's a hallmark. But yeah, they're lovely. Really lovely. I have already been using these. You have seen them um, before. Um, anyway, just quickly. I wanted to show you beach with some of my previous ocean beads. See, it's a bit bigger, but it's all, it's the same size as this one, really. It, it definitely will will fit in with my my beads that I've got for ocean. The other one you might have seen I put it in here and I'll just it's framed by stars I found that to be the perfect combination as um the um the go rounds are quite interesting some of them fit um glass bit glass beads and others just fit the go rounds this one here can fit glass beads which is kind of cool but that's not a new piece and these are not a new piece those are and exciting 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 we have an unboxing today and I've got tropical conch and something to do with love which was a valentine's bead so I'll get those off there now to open it up so we've got these two I'll show you it in a minute and also 
ta-da two more stones well these ones are fossilized um fossilized wood and fossilized shell so they're exciting too so let's, let's have a look at those i'm not i do buy some new releases from time to time but i'm more inclined to want to wait um to make the most of my money and because also troll beads uh, australia do incredible sales absolutely incredible sales i couldn't um, speak more highly of them really um sorry this rod you know beads are kind of little fiddly things and if you like little fiddly things you'll love beads I tend to like, sorry that's the scissors, I tend to like the um, colours and textures and so on to make a design. I'll show, I've got a design I'm wearing, I'll show you right at the end. I wonder if I can see the name of this one. Um, Valentine's Hearts, there you go. Found it. Pretty pretty. And let's see, I'll take this off here. Washing machine going in the background. Pretty. I like, I love pink, so I think that's a really good bead for me. I'll put that one there. And we'll actually do something going backwards a bit. Focus. That's because it's clear. I just wanted to show you this bead because, like, it looks blue, but uh, you can see it's actually clear. Pretty, eh? This one here is more opaque, but so beautiful. And I need to do this to show you just another angle on it like the glitter in there and it's also got a touch of pink which is kind of cool I really liked the beads with the glitter through them I hope they do more like this um, like desert, pink desert and so on alright Let's investigate Tropical Conch. Let's have a look at this one. This is an old beach bead. But still. In some lights it looks purple and other in, in this light it looks kind of brown. Excuse my nails, I have clean hands. Um, however, I work in the family garden during the week um, well I get out there most days because I live here and um, I do that for extended family as well and I'm still going and it's spring and this here was part of the um, spring release from this year and here we have my piece of fossilized wood kind of like collecting the stones um, and I also like being able to um, back purchase one of the cool things about being in the southern hemisphere is that you guys have the um, spring release and then six months later when we can get a discount is, actual, uh, is the actual spring so I mean that's kind of cool for me just saying because um, oh. like I said oh wow yeah 
Okay, it's the um, imperfections that actually make make these beads kind of wow. That's beautiful. Can't wait to design with these. That's why I'm making this video today. Really, mm. shell. Oh wow! I wasn't expecting it to be this beautiful. The the wood one was my first pick, but oh wow! I like the um, orangey sort of earthy colours of this one. Can we go a bit closer? How close can we go? Wow. Guys, if you haven't got these yet, I think you should, because they're really, really unique. Um, sort of being, well, they're fossilised. They are gemstones, but they also are fossilised previous life forms, if you will. So, wood and shell. I don't want to drop those, so let's, um, let's put these all back on here while I finish up for now. Um, I hope you're all having a good day and staying well. Uh, it's actually my son's birthday today. Um, I've got a design to show you too. Hang on. Um, he just turned 14 and he got a really lovely present that my brother recommended but I don't think I'm at liberty to actually tell you what it was but let's go have another squiz at these before I show you one more thing so that's quite a few beads and the reason I waited to film this is so I did have a few beads to show you um just before I finish, sorry about my croaky voice, all the birthday preparations, huh? Bangles, really good. Um, I'm usually doing double spaces, it's my idea of a club. So I've got the daisy spacer from one other, um, I think it might have been a spring release, I'm not sure. The, um, framed by bud go round and then my strawberry quartz go round four sitted have my peace symbol and that lovely bluey green teal and because it's the people's bead release this weekend um, which is um, a little flower this time I've included this one because I haven't Obviously, I'm not close enough to show you um, the latest release at the time of release um, because I don't have a physical shop here. So that's last year's um, People's Speed Atom of Unity. These are both uniques, by the way. Uh, this one here is Zigzag Stitch. And uh, the last um, big event, um, online unique event, um, I think it was the last one. It might have been the one before. They were very popular because they were the new the new bead and they're opaque, which is really cool. That one is not opaque. You can see the sun's coming out now. Yay, I've got washing to hang out. I don't know if you heard my washing machine beeping. And I've got my other strawberry quartz. You can see they're quite different to each other, but that's okay. It's okay, it's the differences that make these wonderful. But like people, you know, it's our differences that make us who we are, make us unique, make us who we are. Um, you know, we need differences. If we're all the same, we'd just be clones, and we don't want that. Um... It's nice to have people that are really like us, but being unique is really cool too. And I had a daughter that, yes, <laughs> here I go, telling a story. Um, 
I used to have a daughter, but, um, <clears throat> sorry, I don't think my voice wants me to tell this one, so I'll leave it. She used to get up and see what I was wearing and go copy it um, in her own little way. And um, they tell me imitation is the highest form of flattery. So thanks, darling. Um, you know who you are. And, um, yeah. <clears throat> Beautiful. So that side's a bit of a repeat, but, yep. I'm actually wearing that today with Pandora rings. And I know, last Pandora video, I said I don't like to mix, but I don't mind doing a ring stack like that and, and troll. It's just, um, just easy off, easy on, wonderful. And sorry about the blurring. I'll just give you another squiz. At the prettiness. I'll probably take a photo of this one and post it on Instagram later if you want to find me there. So like if you like, subscribe if you want to. It's uh, free and sorry about my voice. Uh, clearly have had a lot of um, stuff to organize with uh, my son's boy birthday. Okay, I'll see you for now. Bye!